Hello, and welcome to Watch Me Eat, a show about eating. I'm your host, me. Uh, today I have an extra special show for you, which is about the rarest chips in all of Oregon. Uh, we've got the Juanita, Juanita's a Chilipeno here. And um, it took me uh, two, three years to get some, so I went to extra measures to protect them. Oh boy, do I got a special one for you today. We gotta go. I had to. I had to preserve it. Make sure nobody gets to it. It's too rare. <clears throat> Let's go into the old. Uh, into my old my vault here. <clears throat> One second. Alright, bug and A, nobody getting them down here. Let's do it. Hang on. And man, I really, really don't want to fucking, really don't want to fucking wait any longer. It's very warm today. Oh yeah, ooh yeah. Alright, if you're unfamiliar, uh, Juanita's is like the uh, the dope-ass $2 chips of Oregon or whatever. They're extra nice. Uh, a lot of people would say they're better than most uh, restaurant chips, that kind of thing. And uh, they just a few years ago started secretly making these weird flavored ones. And, uh, you know, people have been shitting their pants. Ooh. So they're, I mean, they're, they're, they're normal ass corn chips, right? But they've uh, created some sort of mixture of um, flavorings here. Fucking God damn it, it's so fucking hot in here. Look, it's only, it's a mess because um, I open up the crawl space to hide these things and let them, we got to get the furnace repaired. There's a lot been going on. I'm mean, so I, all right, I would wish I would be around a lot more, really. Got a little bit of heat to it. A little bit of sweet to it. Mmm. Mmm. They're really nice. Uh, people will go out of their way to track these fucking things down all over the place. This bag is from Barber World Foods in Southwest Portland. It was a long time ago, so don't probably don't bother. I don't know if they would still have them. Anyway, I'm dipping stuff. I'm dipping shit in yogurt now. Because I've actually uh, been, I went to uh, France, and I learned that um, while I love sour cream, I'm dipping shit in European style yogurt now. It's probably just a phase. It totally fucking goes. Honestly, I forgot sour cream. But as an aside, I am actually dipping shit in yogurt these days. Ooh, look at that one. That one got all kinds of shit on there. Oh. A little bit of pepper, a little bit of sugar, sugar, a little bit of um, uh, masa, and, uh, trace of lime. Yeah, I can tell there's a trace of lime. I can taste that torula yeast, you know, paprika, tomato powder. That's a different one. Sugar parsley? What the fuck is sugar parsley? Oh, they let, it's an Oxford comma. Wait a minute, if they've got paprika, why do they also have extractives of paprika? You know, I was just thinking this could use a dash of MSG. It really, it could. It's not fair, but it could. It could benefit. A lot of things could benefit from a dash of MSG, is the short version. Mm. Yeah, that's Microsoft Glutamate. Available at your nearest Asian grocery. Invented by Steve Gates. Okay, so normally when you get a bag of Juanitas, it's just, you know, it's just like a bag of corn chips. You know, they're good for dipping or putting anything in or on or you eat them. And then when you get to about here in the bag, you let them sit for a month and turn into tiny crumbles. 
I'm not sure what happens after that. The delightful balance of uh, sweet and spicy is helping me cope with the destruction of my local environment by the sun. Mm. Ooh. Yogurt goes with more stuff, just to be perfectly clear. I do believe there should be a sour cream conspiracy, but actually I would probably resolve to a yogurt conspiracy. Because there is, you know, it's everywhere. Oh my god. Alright. I think they're getting better as they go down farther. Which would make sense because they were down in the crawl space settling for at least a month or two. Happy Cinco de Mayo! Oh, another news. Oh, hmm. oh, that's real appeasing. That makes me feel like real. I feel content. I feel like I got. Does you feel like when you when you eat it, you can feel like you ate something? Mm. Oh. Well, I mean, really though, right now, <laughs> there is genuinely nothing funny about Doritos. Right now, <laughs> Doritos are so fucking pathetic. It literally shouldn't even be a thing I'm thinking about or talking about. It's a different world. This is a real corn chip that somebody sprinkled real seasonings on. Fuck! I should, uh... Mm. I should have thought ahead more, and instead of burying them under the house, I should have arranged them on a sheet pan and made some nachos. That would be a fucking dope plan. But this is, this is fine. Honestly. I really... Ooh. I'm just glad I didn't, you know, wait longer, bring him farther into the house or anything. If I'd wait in any longer. How rare are these chips? I'd never seen them in person and I first heard about them on the internet. People were talking about how they couldn't find them anyway. You had to go to the factory to get them. I guess the way it works is they have one factory line. When they have extra capacity, they make these. They print the good, the, the wacky flavored chips. But they almost never have the extra space. Hence the rarity. There have been rumors for three years that they were going to get another production line. That's chips! God damn it, they're so fucking good though. Holy shit. Because I mean the default chips, the normal non-flavored Juanitas, are probably the best corn chip template that you could have to put other things on to make the best nachos. And here they've augmented it perfectly. Clearly experts. Oregon's got a really good record when it comes to chips. Maybe you've heard of kettle chips. They've got Tim's as the local version of that idea now. Wacky fucking real corn chips. With a little bit of a space. Visit Oregon! Don't move here. Okay. Alright. There's the, the blood sugar crash from corn. I really appreciate you. I didn't I did intend to be back faster. Fuck me. I'll be back faster. Jalapeno! Chili pin how sweet chili! Sweet chili chips. They have sweet chili chips as well. Where are these ones? We got a chili peno, how huh? one these chili peños. Oh my god. It's the first seasoned chip they developed. The finest seasonings. Eat them alone. Oh I'm sorry, eat them with your favorite dip or alone. <sighs> oh Jesus. God damn it. Chili peños. They're really good. <sighs> Thank you for watching me eat. I guess it's gonna, gonna be summer in a minute here. Again, for me, uh, it was sunny. Thank you for watching me eat chili peno, um, the chips, though, from Juanitas. They're delicious as fucking hell. I'm going to literally just lay on the floor here and have like a big chip coma nap thing. Thank you for joining me. Oh, oh, you got a little bit of a spice on there. Mm. We'll see you next time. It's fine, I just stumped a whole glass of water, it's no big deal.